When I did my EDC video uh, the other night, I showed uh, a collapsible baton that I keep with me in the car. And I got a few requests to show a little more close-up uh, version of that. So I thought I would take that time here to do that. Uh, as you can see, it's just a little rubber encased rod here. It's like a little club. I wouldn't know. It looks like almost a handle to a motorcycle or a, a something. But it's got the rubber gripping on it. Just seems like a big, like I say, big handle to a motorcycle. Uh, and when you flip it, it pops out into a 20 inch steel rod and this thing is brutal I mean it's like getting hit with a lead pipe I was surprised at how firm this is uh, I mean it I just went outside and if you've ever seen those big gallon metal jugs that cooking oil comes in like when we start a restaurant it straight down the middle can tear one in half from top to bottom their strongest point it's I would not want to be hit with this this would kill a person if you struck someone in the head with this hard enough so you'd have to be careful with these because these are definitely very dangerous but uh, Pretty mean little thing. You gotta, gotta tap them on the ground to get them loosened back up enough to even put them back together. As you can see, there not they they lock together pretty tight once you open them. But uh, pretty cool little thing. I got these at the gun show. I paid like twenty dollars for the bigger ones and fifteen for the smaller ones. I got a few of these. Uh, I actually got a little smaller size here too, which is more like a personal size you can put on your belt or something. And you can see it's much smaller, but it pops out into a sixteen inch. Now this one I would feel a little safer hitting someone with. I probably wouldn't kill them with one swat with this. You could, I mean, smacking a temple with this, this will do the same. It was tearing through steel cans also, like they're made of tissue paper. But uh, just a very brutal weapon. And it, you know, it's a very subtle weapon too. I mean, if you had something with this with you, you may not have to resort to deadly force. If you whack someone in the knee, whack someone in the elbow, whack someone in the collarbone with one of these, I guarantee you'd take the fight out of somebody. But uh, people wanted me to show these. They're pretty simple. Pretty cheap too, and I've seen them all over the place online. I just happened to buy them at the gun show because I bought. I think they were really like third, twenty-five for the small one, thirty for the big ones. But because I bought six of them, I got uh, fifteen dollars for the small ones, or was it twelve dollars maybe even, and twenty dollars for the the great, the big ones here, the twenty inches. So really nice item. I would recommend most anyone that's ever thinks they might be in a situation where they may have to defend themselves to carry one of these. Uh, my sister is a security guard and she walks a plant and she is actually allowed to carry a baton and I got her one of these to carry with her and she loves it. She said this would smack the crap out of somebody if she ever had to. So uh, really nice little item like I said I would recommend if you see them pick one up because they're cheap and never ever underestimate the effectiveness of a steel club.